Hello everyone, um, it's Clinton. I wanted to talk today about what I learned from 2021. Um, basically, a lot of the things I learned kind of fall under the same category. So it might not be a crazy list, but it might be a few sort of subjects that I learned. Not subjects, but like uh, what, what, what am I trying to say? It's just a few things that I learned that I cover a range of categories in, you know, in, in different topics. They sort of range around the same things, qualities, I should say. Um, yeah, so one of the things that I learned from 2021 was that things can change like that if you stay consistent in whatever you do. Um, it might be a relationship you're looking for, it might be a job that you're looking for, it might be to fix a relationship, it might be to buy a certain thing or achieve a certain goal. But I, I learned last year that if you have a consistent, if you have a plan and you're consistent with that plan, things can change like that. It's, uh, it's the same analogy as the ice in the room where if you reduce the temperature in the room to maybe I'm paraphrasing, this is not the exact sort of temperature, but if you reduce, if you put ice, an ice block in a room and you reduce the temperature from, you know, to increase the temperature, sorry, to maybe let's say 35 degrees, nothing happens, the ice still remains intact. But if you switch the ice from, let's say, hypothetically 36 degrees to 37 degrees, that one shift in that degree change completely melts the ice. And I feel like that's the same thing with being consistent in whatever you do. You could be going and work and work and work and work and you're, you know, putting your plan together and working, everything might be perfect. And I like, hypothetically that plan that you've put together might be the 35th temperature you know of the temp room temperature to melt the ice but you just need that one shift in temperature to change everything and that applies for melting ice as apply as it does apply to life as well so everything can change quickly if you stay consistent um what else did I learn? I learned that discipline is everything. Yeah, I learned that discipline is everything. Discipline is everything. In And for me personally, you know, I like to work out. I like to exercise. So discipline was a big key for me last year in terms of just feeling how I wanted to feel, in terms of building my confidence, in terms of just a lot of things. It, it sort of snowballed into a lot of different things, you know, because I was consistent in my workout and exercise. It gave me the credibility with myself and it also gave me the confidence with myself to go and pursue other things and build on, on top of other things and new habits. So, yeah, discipline was a massive thing for me last year and uh, it will continue to continually be a massive thing for me this year. Um, what else? I learned that you should never put your, you know, happiness externally i mean i think happiness is almost like a light on a candle you know you have yours and you can spread yours to others and by spreading yours to others doesn't mean it takes it any you know any away any flame <laughs> words <laughs> happiness is like a candle light you can take a candle light and spread it to other candles and light their candles but that doesn't mean it, it takes anything away from you it takes anything away from your candlelight you know and I think happiness is the same thing if it's internal you know you make yourself the source of your happiness you can spread that happiness to other people but by spreading it it doesn't take anything away from you because you are the genuine source of that happiness you know and I just feel like I learned last year that when you start to depend on the external for your happiness, things can get a bit hard and a bit rocky. And it's a, it's a, it's a, you know, rocky road to go on when, when you derive happiness always from the external. Um, I feel for me anyways, what I learned was that being me being the source of my own happiness was everything. And it, it drove everything 
so it allowed me to be consistent in whatever I wanted to do because when I fulfilled my goals, when I fulfilled my 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 discipline goals, like my exercise goals and, and things like that, it made me it, like a genuine, long lasting sense of happiness, you know? And uh, yeah, from that, I just built on top of that. But um, yeah, just being the source of your happiness is extremely important for me personally. Um, yeah. Uh, last year was a it was it was a it was a really interesting year of learning i learned i learned a lot of things and everything else that i kind of learned just falls underneath the things i just mentioned but yeah fall falls under the umbrella of or whatever i just mentioned previously but um yeah those were those were the interesting things that i learned last year i'll probably think of some more and make another video but so far, that's all I got.